what up people this is priscilla you made up priscilla's kitchen lc.com let's talk nigerian stew for one second listen nigerian stew is absolutely tomato based bunch of red bell peppers and habanero or scotch bonnet as the case may be it is varied according to tribes and tongues and the likes okay so now let's see it from priscilla's uh, way okay now let's get after it okay i have on the other pot that is cooking on the stove i'm boiling all my proteins that will be beef tribe goat meat and beef three different variations i don't typically cook with a lot of proteins but today i feel like it i am just as an homage to my grandmother all right here we go into that blender i have added 60 percent tomato uh fresh tomatoes roma tomatoes to be precise and then i added 20 percent of red bell pepper that has been peeled and deveined all right so then 10 percent of onions and then the other will be this tomato paste in a in another pan i added olive oil and then i added the tomato uh, paste first and that's because it, it has more intense raw taste of tomato so it is important to cook that out so i cooked it for five minutes and then i added the blended uh, tomato base okay so now together let's season this is stew as the name implies it needs to go on a medium low medium to high heat uh no low to medium heat and it's gonna need to cook for a long time to cook out all the raw taste so i added priscilla's house seasoning priscilla's uh tagine spice beans and dry thyme the reason for these choices it is stew it needs to go low and slow and i love more garlic so i added more garlic now you want to cover this this to go for 20 good minutes on the stop you want to stay occasionally your goal is to stew and cook of that rotis here we go i showed you my spices please get on my website priscilla's kitchen llc.com and get yours so 25 minutes later i opened it stirred it and now i'm adding my air fried proteins that i had already previously mentioned all right now look why did i air fry it yes, give it uh, give it some texture and most important it's going to go low and slow for another 10 to 15 minutes it's going to flavor your stew and then it's going to be so delicious i am telling y'all okay the best part of this stew you can switch it up or switch it down you can choose any type of protein you want now 10 minutes later i'm showing you still more bubbles coming up that's moisture you don't want that water it needs to cook out so this time keep it uncovered and let it go low and slow all right all together it takes about 45 minutes to get you a tastiest nigerian stew i'm telling you and this is ready five minutes later is ready to take on i am telling you white rice tomato uh, potatoes yams you name it or you could even just put this on a vegetable is how delicious it can be i am ready for my white rice and i thank you for watching please subscribe hit the little bell so you know when i put out a video i love you all Nigerian stew, Priscilla's way. Bye-bye.